I'd like to do something for a second and just uh, address something that I said actually about Snowden yesterday uh, in relation to that Snowden story and Glenn Greenwald, the Guardian journalist who broke the Snowden story. I put my foot in my mouth and I'm sorry about this uh, when I veered into hyperbole and suggested that he almost be arrested. That was the quote and I have to say it didn't come out right and I misspoke. Uh, I'm sorry I said it that way uh, and I'm sorry I said it. I didn't realize actually the way I said it until later when I saw the clip. Uh, just a little context because I know there was uh, some media around this. I was trying uh, as we did in another segment to raise a question not about the legality of publishing the leaked information about the NSA but about the implications if a journalist aided someone like Snowden in trying to evade authorities on the run and what that would all mean and I overstepped with my language. Let me be clear just a couple things here. Uh, I believe of course in the First Amendment and transparency and of course investigative journalism like the reports about the NSA programs and I think there are fair and important questions to be asked about the government and our privacy on this ongoing story but I also think there are fair questions to be asked about Snowden himself and the role of the media. But on my comment I got about Greenwald, I regret it. You know, we do live uh, TV for three hours every single day, and sometimes we make a mistake, say things uh, we don't mean, and uh, we hope uh, that when we do, we acknowledge it and correct it. And uh, I wanted to do that here on this program. We're back in just a moment.